a ton of interest. You are arriving via the Exhibition Road entrance. You have exited South Kensington Tube Station. You are arriving via the Grand Entrance on Cromwell Road. Welcome to the world's most famous Museum of Art and Design. Your mission is to gain knowledge and experiences from the V&A in order to discover the mystery behind a legend of creation. The legend is at a secret place in the V&A. The more experience you achieve, the higher the level you will gain and the closer you will get to completing your mission. You are entering the new Renaissance Gallery. Who are you? What are you doing here? Who am I? What a ridiculous question. For a man actor, working under the guidance of Will Shakespeare, the great playwright. Now leave me to learn my lines. Put money in thy purse. It was your that Ricky Wrench wild me and theft my jollity, but she rankles me still. What does this guy want? Sorry, I was just watching you. What do you want, you dirty peasant? All I want to know is how to find them Camberwell Youth Group. C -c -c Camberwell? What is Camberwell? I have other duties to do. Okay. You are now in the past course. Oi, how do I leave this land of death and find the Create Voice Youth Forum? Oh, pardon me, thou bleeding piece of earth, that I am meek and gentle with these butchers that art the ruins of the noblest man that ever lived in the tide of times. Woe to the hand that shed this costly blood. Over thy wounds do I now prophesy, which like dumb mouths do ope their ruby lips. These are hands-on exhibits. You may touch them. Please stand clear of the exhibit area. Please stand clear of the exhibit area. Please stand clear if you head up to the theatre and performance galleries, I think you might find something that interests you. Oh, it's cold in here. Please bring me back a costume while you're there. You are now entering the John Medeski Garden. This door is out of bounds. It was lovely to meet you. And you. And don't get lost again. No, I won't. Actually, I'm looking for the shop. Do you know where it is? The lady over there will oh. be able to help you. Oh, thank you very much for everything. Bye. Okay, bye. Where the hell is this Campbellwell College Design Group? This is the British Gallery. Oh. Hi, um. Hello. Have you got anything for young people? We have our Create programme, so Create Performance is the new theme, but every couple of months we've got a different theme around this Create branding. At the moment we've got an exhibition at the main entrance called Decode, which is an interactive exhibition looking at digital design. As part of that we're doing a whole design festival around it this weekend. Everything goes up on the website and there's a whole young person section that you can check. We have a Create Voice Youth Forum and they're always looking for new members. You have a say in all the different events that we put on in the museum and how the museum is interacts with young people. And that's, yeah, I've got one last question. Do you know where the shop is at all? You are now at the Ceramic Staircase. You are now in the Silver Galleries. You may now stand at the V&A hallmark. Hey, you're looking for the Great Voice Youth Forum? It can be found in the Sacra Centre. Now leave me stuck on the wall. Cheers, mate. Finally. I work here at the V&A and I noticed that you have um, a card for our Camberwell um, student marketing the V&A to 16 to 24 year olds event. Yeah. I'm Laura. Nice to meet you. Hi. Would you like me to show you where it is? Yeah. Yeah? yeah. Oh, well, come with me then. We'll go downstairs to the Sackler Centre. The name of our project is Meet Me at the v &A. It's to encourage 16 to 24 year olds to come to the v &A as a meeting place so that they can interact with the collection. These are a few of the lines that we came up with based on the artefacts that are kept there. Meet me by the horny chair. 
Meet Me by the Lion's Bulls, Meet Me by the Lazy Cow. It's really trying to find the most humorous part of the museum and something that would attract young people there. We also have these appointment cards as well, which we thought would be really good to be left around London. And the idea is that you would maybe use the v as a place to date. And you put your name and phone number on the back of one of the cards. So if they were left around in a pub or bar or something, then it's an easy way of passing on the information. One was charmed by the beautiful face of the young Albert. I have developed delicate feelings for the lovely little man and I hope to set my eyes upon his beautiful face once again. I'm Henry VIII and I just killed another wife. We are the vandalists that we have taken over the V&A. We want to make the V&A available to young people. We want to create a place where they want to come and have parties and enjoy themselves and learn. You may now purchase items in the shop. We have reached the Sackler Centre Art Studio. Create Voice is a forum meant for young people from 16 to 21 years old who are interested in arts, interested in knowing more about the Victoria and Albert Museum and getting involved in activities. What I enjoy about Create Voice is the range of people that it encapsulates. And another thing I absolutely love about it is the fact that in the VNA we have such a range of traditional and modern. We're attempting to sort of mix together these different sorts of artworks. Do you know how to get to the Digital Pioneers of it? Oh right, it's just down the corridor. Have you had a look round in here? Um, no really. Could you show me about? Yeah, because I was the curator for these galleries. So, what does, that, what does that mean? It means that I look after all the objects in the collection. This is the Theatre and Performance Gallery, so we tried to make it so that people would want to go to a performance after they've been. So we have things like the Rhino which is actually a prop like a pantomime horse so that two people would get inside. You are now at the residency studios. The residency here is for six months, but just to clarify that the artists don't live here. You base your working practice, so your studio is here. We work in order to develop your own artwork, your own art practice. You engage with the public, you engage in education programs, and you engage with the staff of the VNA in order to forge a kind of working relationship between contemporary art and the V&A as an institution. Well the V&A is an inspiring place to be. In its history it has affected the UK as a place of great innovation. It can inspire young people to find interest and bring their own backgrounds to the V&A. You are now at the Please enter the Hockhauser Auditorium to see the digital animation. We had to make a stop-motion animation and we had to get inspiration from something in the museum. It's um, a good learning experience because I got to try out some new programs and hopefully that will help me out when I uh, apply to university. We're also going to be mentoring the next people who are going to join the course and I'd like to share my experience with them. Hello, hello. Anyway, you've, you've had a very, very interesting and exciting time here. Exciting as it was, I think that the next time you come, you need to find out as much about the thing that you're fascinated by uh, as you can, because if you do that, you'll find how relevant everything you see here is to your lives. It will tell you so much not only about the past, but also about you. Because it's all about comparing things and trying to understand things from other people's point of view. Who made that amazing thing? Could anybody make it today? Where did it come from? I'm going to discover all the things that I need to find out here. What do you think is special about the V&A? 
And how has it influenced your own creativity? It was the first museum I ever came to. I moved to London when I was 17. We used to come on the train once a week for a whole day and sketch in here. So you could just discover whatever you wanted and focus on it and you had to just do a drawing of it. Anyway, we loved coming. It's very exciting going to the Kensington tube station. You can go under the tunnels and come up here through the tunnel. Do you think that V&A can free the imagination of young people? I think that the only way you ever know anything is through your imagination. It's the way you get knowledge because you don't get it from reason. Reason is something you do to check things later. But knowledge comes to you in flashes. You get one thing and it connects with another and you think, I understand something about that. And I think all these objects and the things that are in here, they've got feelings and you understand things sometimes by feeling. Later on through reason, you can try and analyze what that was. What people don't understand sometimes when they go to a museum is that it is relevant to their lives today. Because if you understand the way people saw the world in the past, it tells you something about the age in which you live. What are you thinking? Maybe the way other people saw things is better than the way you saw things or whatever. That's the root of intelligence. It's the root of understanding the world you live in. We know that you're interested in the environment. So how do you think that will affect the future of fashion? What you can do now is so much more important than what you can do tomorrow. And I don't think we will solve our problems unless everybody in the world starts to understand that every problem they have, it has to be seen in the context of climate change. As for fashion, I don't know what you wear when you've got nowhere to go, no water to drink, I really don't know. What was it like having an exhibition here at the Victorian Albert Museum? It was 30 years work and it was like putting a lake into a bottle to concentrate it all. It was an incredibly prestigious thing to happen to me because the V&A has this amazing prestige anyway and they did the most wonderful wonderful job and it just looked great and it had record attendances and so I was really grateful to be able to show people what I did it was a great opportunity for me to see my work as well I'm glad you've enjoyed yourself so much and um, I think that the next time you come you'll start to get more and more out of out of coming here.